In August 2022, Stopgap invited disabled dance artists from the UK to spend several days in the studio with Italian disabled dance artists Aristide Rontini and Giuseppe Comuniello. We explored what inclusive creativity and disabled leadership means. Hannah Sampson, a white learning disabled person, speaks to camera. For me, disabled leadership means to speak up and make that change in the world. Panning around the studio, dancers lay in various positions on the floor, reclining as they listen to another artist who walks between them. Laura Jones, a white disabled woman, speaks to camera. For me, disabled leadership is going beyond basic inclusion and tokenism and giving disabled people the resources to be decision makers, giving them the opportunity to remove barriers in a creative and meaningful way that will benefit all of society. Dances during a workshop delivered by Aristide Rontini, a disabled Italian man who speaks to camera. To me, disabled leadership means to give space, time, responsibility to artists with disability to develop their artistic vision and artistic practice. Moments of contact between dancers, working with their eyes closed, soft palms caress and support one another. One dancer cradles another's head, limbs tangled with layers of hands. Sherry Brennan, a white, non-disabled woman, speaks to camera. Disabled leadership means to me that disabled people's lived experience, knowledge and ideas should be actively listened to, that their voices are respected and disabled people should be in leadership roles from the very beginning. We open the mouth as much as we, as we can. During a workshop, dancers widen and scrunch up their faces in exaggerated expressions. They then travel across the space in small groups. Nadan, a wheelchair dancer, pushes himself from the floor to return upright. He tucks up his front wheels and balances in a wheelie, then rolls away. This residency is part of a 12-month creative exchange programme between Stopgap Dance Company and a consortium of Italian arts organisations led by Oriente Occidente. The programme is funded by the British Council's International Collaboration Grants, which are designed to support UK and overseas organisations to collaborate on international arts projects. Stopgap Dance Company Supported by Oriente Occidente, British Council, Farnham Maltings and Arts Council England.